Last time on Phoenix Wright, Ace Attorney. They're saying this, the the steel samurai killed a villain. Um, isn't that what he's supposed to do? Yeah, on TV. Yeah, on TV. No, I mean he actually did it in real life. <laughs> He skewered a villain with his samurai spear! I have absolutely no idea what you're talking about. <laughs> and now, back to objecting. It's Vin Dilly Machinette here again. Last time, I think we were... had... a samurai. So, alright. So let's do this. Yep, alright, here we go. It's time... for the trial. October 18th, 10 a.m. This is court number four. The court is now in session for the trial of Mr. Will Powers. I forgot what my judge's voice was. So, this is my judge's voice now. Prosecution is ready, Your Honor. Your Honor. Your Honor. Your Honor. Governor. Can't do it. I, I need a bad good accent. Cockney? Uh, yeah. The fit is ready, Your Honor. Very well, Mr. Edwards. Please open the statement, please. The prosecution will show the court at 2.30 p.m. on October 15th. The defendant, Mr. Will Powers, killed fell actor Jack Hammer at Studio One of Global Studios. It is impossible for anyone else to have committed this heinous crime. The evidence presented during the trial will all point to this fact. Hmm. I see. Hmm. I see. Very well. I would like to move on to your testimony. Mr. Edgeworth, the prosecution may call its first witness. First, I would like to call the familiar face Detective Gumshoe to stand. Governor? <laughs> Governor? Well. Detective Gumshoe, if you would, briefly describe this case to the court. Governor? Yes, sir, pal. I play with my guide map here, pal. 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 <gasps> Understand this case is important to grasp the layout of the studio. See? This here's the employee area. Actors did a, the actors did a run through their action scenes during the morning here. You see? It's the main gate to the, air, the studios. We got the three lady that works in the studios here at 1 p.m. on that day. Security station, there's, there's a gate, see? Past that area of the studios. And here it is, Studio One. The scene of the murder, where the body was found. And on the day of the murder, October 15th, there's only three people here the victim Jack Hammer, the defendant Will Powers, a young woman, the production assistant. All the production staff were in the employee area until noon. After lunch, the victim, Jack Hammer, went to the studio one. After that, at 1 p.m., the security guard when he got to the guard station. 
jump ahead to later that day, 5 p.m. Rex and the staff came to see you once before the rehearsal. He used to say the rehearsal was cancelled. And the death was 2.30 p.m. Samurai Spear found wads in the victim's chest with the murder weapon. That's the case, that's, that's the case, that's the case of brief, pal. You want to hear that again? Hmm. See that whole thing again? Yes. I think I can probably remember that. The murder weapon was a spear. How medieval. Samurai Spear added the court record. Yeah, Anna. This case is quite simple if you ask one question. And that question is... What did the security lady at the guard station see? <clears throat> Understood. Understood. Let's call the security officers, officers to the stand, Governor. The witness to we to declare her name. Mm. Ah, aren't you a handsome fella? I'm afraid I'm a bit flustered. <laughs> yeah, your, your name, please. <laughs> oh dear, don't need to be embarrassed. Just call me Grandma. Your name, please. Hmm. Seems Edward has a bit of a problem getting witnesses to say their names. Windy, windy old bag, dearie. Windy old, windy old bag, dearie. <laughs> Objection! Objectiveness talkative! I object to witness talkativeness! Objection sustained! The witness will refrain from rambling on the stand. I'll just get to the good part, Derek. Perhaps we get to the testimony? The witness was stationed naked the day of the murder, correct? Yes, see, I was. And to get to see the murder, someone went to pass by you? You know your, st you know your stuff, dearie. <laughs> you may begin your testimony. She sure is one hell of an old bag. Witness account. <coughs> the day of the murder, I arrived at the guard station. 1 p.m. Poor old Hammer had been the rest had been doing a run through there since the morning. <coughs> well, I well, I had some errands to run th through that morning. Anyway, it was 1 p.m. I got to the guard station. <coughs> Over the main gate from then to around 5. The murder happened at 2.30 p.m., right? Interesting to me because a certain man walked by me right at 2 p.m. It was Powers, and that man right there, he was heading towards the studio. You saw the defendant then, right? Mm -hmm. Very well, let's begin the question examination. Mr. Wright? Yes, Your Honor. On the day of the murder, I arrived to the station around 1 p.m. Who did that time? Anyone who wanted to go to, go to the studio? There wasn't a security guard at the gate, no. The gate was locked, Gary. You pull a key card to get in. Right, the key card. That I have. She's saying it no one that wasn't supposed to be there could get in. The 
tortillas when you arrive at the gas station? The rest of the we have run through there since this morning. A run through? They're working out of the scene to be on the samurai and the magistrate. We just figured it out by noon. Do you see afternoon for practice? We're still put we're still put start at five. The Pipora hammer with the Thea one afternoon. I was in his dressing room sleeping when he was supposed to be practicing. But laid back hero. Oh, there's a run through in the after morning. Why did you get there in the afternoon? Uh, uh, I had some errands to run that morning. What kind of errands? Oh, well, you know. It's answer the question! Actually, I was watching Coral, Hammer, and, and Powers observing, you know. Observing? Weren't you supposed to be at the guard station? Well, first ever, I told you I'd like to get, didn't I? I did my job! I'm not sure your boss would see it that way. Anyway... I was watching Hammer's run-throughs. Always! I missed one in all my years. Wow! I want to see a steel samurai run through too! You could quit me in a spirit medium and take up guard duty. <laughs> Not a bad idea! It was, it was 1 p.m. like Anyway, it was 1 p.m. that I got the guard station. Did you see the victim then? Did I, see, did I see poor old ha Hammer? Nope. He'd already gone back to the studio before I got, I got back to the guard station. Tell us what happened next. I was at the main gate. I was at the main gate from, from then until five. She watched him there the whole time. No breaks, not even for a second. Of course! I'm a professional, you know. I'm a professional, you know. Or are you quit how to do my job, Wimper Snapper? No, just after seeing you eat those donuts and yard tasting yesterday. I can watch the eat I can watch the gate and eat donuts at the same time. <laughs> snipper Snipper Whapper Snipper Whapper? Oh, the wind bag is losing it, Nick! Aren't you raising an objection? So the, so the witness was on duty the whole, to the afternoon the whole time. Very well. What did you see? The murder happened at 2.30... The murder happened at 2.30 p.m., right? How did you know that? Oh, who are my ways? The overdressed young detective told me. I fed him some donuts and he talked and talked. He asked me that detective was cut out for his job. Mm hmm. Poor Detective Gumshoe, being chewed out by a security guard. Interesting to me because a, a certain young man walked by right. right walked right by me at 2 p.m. 2 p.m., you're sure? Sure as spit. Well, who was the man? Really? Really? You said try to get so excited at your age. Might strain something. Hmm? I don't know. Your screws are all, all the buttons. I'll tell you who it was. It was Powers, that man right there, and he's heading towards the studio. See, so saw Mr. Powers. But I said, I got rocks in your ears, Sonny. Nick, this is your chance. You had time to pull out the secret weapon. I'll say it again. It was him. Objection! <laughs> 
<laughs> Let me get this straight, old bag. Er, Miss Old Bag. <laughs> You've been saying since yesterday you saw Mr. Powers, correct? <laughs> You're talking about this man in the photo, aren't you? Yes, the moment, Mr. Wright. You see that proto? What is this exact? What is this exactly? None other than the Steel Samurai Defender of Neo Tokyo. This old tag. Is this the Mr. Parrot that you saw? Of course! Didn't your mama teach you any sense, son? If you want to completely see, that's Paris, right? Um, yeah. Um, well. I wonder. True, Mr. Powers does play the role of the Steel Samurai. But, as it means Mr. Powers is the Steel Samurai, I, I know that. I was born yesterday. <laughs> no one, no one is quite excusing you as that, Miss or uh, uh, witness. It's how people calling her old bag, apparently. However, you're not proof that the person that photo is Mr. Will Powers, do you? Huh? No, the old man. Of course, I have proof. What? Huh? <laughs> it's perfectly surprised. <coughs> prosecution was like the, the prosecution would like to ask the old the witness. Please make known Please make known all the information in your processions ahead of time. Oh sorry, how's up no everyone would be so noisy. You should be a saying to all of you. Anyway, I saw that photo of the young detective. Hey, tell me. Hey, tell me this isn't, isn't good evidence, pal. It, it ain't good, say it, look. Well, old windbag has left even the Edward speechless. She's good. Well, should about your proof, then? I, I, ne I never said anything. I don't mean mind you. <coughs> that morning during the run through the acting scene, I saw Paris trip and fall. They were from the pops. It was a big mess. Apparently he sprained his ankle pretty bad. Now look at this picture. You can see he's dragging his leg. See, clear as day. I knew it was Powers. Happy? Uh, so he sprained his ankle. Very well. Mr. Wright, you may cross-examine the witness. He's hiding something. I'll press her until, I'll press her until she squeals. It's not anything. I never, saw any, never, I never say anything I don't mean, mind you. Um, supper. Okay. I'll be now. I'm not pointing at, at anyone behind the back. Everything I've said is on the straight and narrow. The up and up. Each day, always whining about each other. Point. Right. That's right. He's probably sick. Turned up to the witness. I think Edgeworth has his match. Who is president to run through? Well, let's see. There was Powers, he's the still samurai. Then the part of hammer, evil magistrate, and me. And what exactly were you doing? Uh, observing, just, just observing. What about the assistant? Ah, uh, 
see us after the impact traps that surround the set. So see the run through then. I saw power of trip and fall. Trip and fall? What is that? <laughs> yes. Yes. And I think he is putting this still samurai. What a laugh. The power spray his ankle. I helped make it better for him, of course. You helped make it better? <laughs> Kissed it where it hurt. Let's go to this part, shall we? Where was the assistant then? Oh, her? She's up the backdrops, I think. Didn't know about the power of Sankle. Hmm. Let me continue your testimony. Look on the props. It was a big mess. He broke a prop? Sure, he did. His own samurai spear. His samurai spear. The murder weapon. Look at how I was there to fix it with my duct tape. Look at how I was there with my duct tape to fix it. Duct tape fixes everything, you know? This record is a significant detail. I better write this down in the court records. Samurai Spear updated in the court records. Apparently, he's making this angle pretty bad. Mr. Rick is ankle badly sprained. So bad he can't walk around. There's a room that gets set after lunch. That's the nap. Anyway, I saw him dragging his foot when he walked. Dragging his foot? Okay. I think you're fair enough. Have a wee honor. Well, there's one thing that bothers me. Which is? Which is? <coughs> where's, where's the steel samurai costume now? Um, um, actually, well, we couldn't find it. We're looking, we're looking through, Governor. Hmm. Anyway, that's not important. Doing this dead to this little samurai, yes. <coughs> that's because the, this person in this little samurai pursuit must be triple powers. Hmm, suppose that's right. Are you sure? Sure, are you sure you're sure? Your honor. Well, right there. Possibilities, but we agree that this is for the show, so Samurai. No, this foot, nowhere in this photo can we see Mr. Will Powers. Hmm. The fence has a point. So I wonder if someone else. If not caught camera, could have killed Mr. Hammer. Well, as you can see, that we have to consider that possibility also. Ho ho ho! Then allow me to remove that doubt from your mind, Your Honor. The witness continue your testimony, please. No need to ask twice. <coughs> the time before Hammer's death was 2.30 p.m., true? The person I saw go to the studio before then was Will Powers. Else, no one else went there. If they had, I would have seen them. Hmm. Who was in the studio? It has to be the still samurai who did it. It's alright. May cross examine the witness. Oh. When is the count continued? The time of poor Hammer's death was 2.30 p.m., true? Hey. How do you know that? Uh, didn't I just explain? You done us the young detective. And then, after some rubbish about being a secret pal, he told me everything. He told me everything. I see. 
Detective Dempsey shares his fellow officer's fondness for donuts. That's all the studio all powers. Photograph one more time. <laughs> the photo was taken by this camera at the, the studio, correct? Yes, sir, is, Sonny. <laughs> so, whenever, so whenever he passes through by here, my please take a photo, picture, picture. I hear I thought you didn't know your head from a hole in the ground. <laughs> right. Anyway, it's also true that the computer in the security space in the guard station records all security ca cam data. Oh, uh, uh, if you know, you know, if you want to work at the studio, we might have an opening. <coughs> that very computer printed out this photo. Then on the on the back of the. On the back of the photo are printed the words, October 15th, 2 p.m. Photo number two. Even I know that, that even I know that means it was printed at 2 p.m. October the 15th. Really, Senna? Actually, I knew that too. The issue is, here is the bit in where it says, photo Number two. Photo number two? Peter only held data for one photo on that day. Don't you think that's odd? Shouldn't this photo be photo number one of photo number one if it if was the if shouldn't this photo be photo number one if it was the only photo? Catch out! <coughs> order, order! <coughs> Please look for what you mean by this, Mr. Wright. Actually, that's what I wanted to ask the witness. <coughs> this evidence shows that not one, but two people in this studio that day. Yet, there's only, only data for one of the photos. Oh boy, <coughs> who could have raised the data for the other photo? Only someone with access? The security lady herself. Sure. You watch your mouth, Whimper Snapper. First I saw the day was Will Powers. The camera at the gate fired twice. That means two people went by. <coughs> um, well, yes, that's what it would seem to me. The witness explained to, the, to this court. Um, uh, well, I understand these two things up here things. Um, Edgy Boy, help! Edgy Boy, help! Huh? Believe me, I want to. But I don't know what this means, Eva. Oh, I hope you are. You're a whimper snapper too. Whimper snapper? Something matter, Mr. Something the matter, Mr. Mr. Old Bag? Oh, that's right. I I just remember something. Let me guess. Someone else passed by the gate. Someone other than the still samurai. Er, well, yes, I suppose you could put it that way. I see. Your testimony, please. The other person. Every day, I have to finish my guard duties. I have one important job to do. <coughs> I go through the photos recorded. I go through the photos recorded on the security computer and check them. 
After all, these puddles there are suspicious are looking, you see? Come to think of it, now I remember throwing out as one photo that day. Miss Oldberg, this is the first I've heard of this. Well, of course, Senna. I only just remembered it. Right, anyway, Mr. Wright, please begin the cross examination. <laughs> well, I'd say this is a turn of the unexpected, but I kind of expected this. Other person. Every day after I finished my guard duties, I have a job to do. Another job? That's right, I took all the people that's by the thing that day. The one of the photos I screen card takes? They come all the two camera data? Well, they keep telling me to, yes. Those computers are just so frustrating. I thought I put those dark spots looking, you see? How do you exactly determine what's, what is a suspicious looking? Can you tell by looking at their faces for the most part? For the most part. This is a bird from Soul Bag! Well, I didn't have to shoot some power, did I? Thinks he's missing the point. But now I remember finding out one photo that day. Well, who wouldn't heck was that in the photo you erased? Huh, a fanboy. Fanboy? Still a samurai fanboy. Real freaks you ask me. Real freaks you ask me. Get yeah, information about the rehearsals from Gosh Nowhere. That was thinking about when I was there that day. Objection. Wait a second. You say no one else could get in? I like the main gate. No one could get in. Those were your words. Well, <coughs> if you must know, there's a drain that goes. Into the employee area. The grate has been loose for a while. It leads outside, and well, that's where they, they that's where they came in. They come in through the drain. I told you they were freaks. Oh, and and they're kids, children. Wimper snappers. Kids? It's on the photo that you raised. It was a boy, probably second or third grade. What? Order. Order? Order made a turkey sandwich. Still that line from someone else, other YouTuber. <laughs> it's straight. The two people passed by that gate on their way to the studio that day. One was a still samurai dragging his leg. And there was a boy who looked to be about second or third grade. Oh yes, well, oh yes, well, we see the type there every, every day. Can't stop him, can't catch him. A boy in second or third grade, hmm. I assume it would be hard, if not impossible, for a young boy to wield a samurai spear. Impossible, impossible, I think. It's quite heavy. Right, <coughs> as I said, I, I didn't pay him much, much mind. That's why I erased the data. Oh, Nick! What's going on? I mean, the boy was there. That makes him a suspect. Yeah, they're already trying to unsuspect them. Oh, they take a five minute recess. I like to, I, I want to defend and the prosecution to consider this new information. And no forgetting for information this time.
October 11th, October 18th, 11.08 a.m., Sir Court, Event Lobby number, two, number 3. Mr. WP? Yes? Tell me straight, were you really in dressing room? You didn't go to the studio? I didn't go to the studio. I was sleeping. Honest. So who was the steel samurai in the security photo? How should I know? The steel samurai costume was off in the corner of the dressing room. Anyone could have walked in and taken it. Really? What? You should take better care of that stuff! I couldn't imagine anyone who'd want to steal a steel samurai costume. So, where does this leave me? It doesn't look good. Sniff. You're the only likely suspect right now. Nick! What are we gonna do? She push me first to be play for more time. We'll start targeting someone else who could conceivably have done that. Right! I'll, and, and it'll take them so long to just down that we can get another day! <coughs> right, if we pick the wrong person, we might lose on the spot. Don't sound very optimistic. <coughs> I'm not optimistic at all, really. Actually. Hey, Nick! It's time! Okay. Let's go. Sigh. What does that mean? Please don't sigh like that. Sniff. The court will now re the, the court will now reconvene the trial of Mr. Will Powers. <coughs> Mr. Mr. Redgeworth, will you present the prosecution's thoughts on this matter? Prosecution's the prosecution's thoughts are simple. Nothing has changed. The other person who went to the studio was a boy. Roughly 10 years of age. The photo we do have, have may not be hard evidence. But there's but there's still no one else who committed the crime. I call for a verdict of guilty of the attendant, Mr. Will Powers. Hmm. Very well, Mr. Wright. Your thoughts? The defense is basically to prosecute his claims. There's another person who committed this this crime. Order. Interesting. Let's hear you have in mind, however. Beware this court does not look kindly on accusing the innocent. If you accuse someone, someone who is obviously innocent, you will be penalized. Right. Wait, the stakes weren't high enough. Or... So who's this person that other Mr. Powers that committed the murder? The girl, high school boy, the security lady. It was a security lady. Win the old bag. Why did I say? Why? Why did I say that with that accent? I don't know. Who? The steel samurai dragging his leg in this photo, in this picture. That means whoever was in that student knew about that morning's injury. Maybe because they've been watching the accident scene run through. There's only one per other person, other than the power of the hammer, that knew about that injury. The security lady. Windy old bag. What? What? Whipper steppers? Order. Order? Is this true old bag? 
old bag. That's Miss Old Bag to you. Miss Old Bag was staying alone. Uh, the guard stayed oh, staying guard alone at the main gate. She was by herself. In other words, she has no alibi. Can't yeah, believe you left to post this to the. To steal the still samurai costume. This looked in the studio one to see the murder. Why? Why would you go through the trouble of wearing the still samurai costume? Simple, Your Honor. She and the cameras at the gate would take her picture. If she was in his costume, she put the finger at Mr. Powers. Uh, Oh, I see! Excellent detective reasoning, Mr. Wright. Oh, yeah. Right here? Sherlock Holmes, too, baby. That's odd. Isn't the part, isn't this the part where Edward, Edward pounces? Doesn't he usually jump up with an objection and some new damning evidence? Well, Mr. Edgeworth, do you have prosecution have an opinion on this murder? Hmm. The prosecution has no meaningful objections at this time. What? 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 That's what the mean? Oh, see, so I think I did. Is that it? Edgy boy, don't just sit there, do something. <coughs> What's my move? Maybe now is my chance to take this whole, ho take this whole, take, take this the whole way. The very same reason that Mr. Powers is suspect in this case, he used to cut doubt on this old back accident that day. But why would I just even, but, but why would I just be so horrible the poor hammer? You forget that Mr. Powers lacks a clear motive too. Hmm, indeed. That did it. Now win back is one of the, the suspects. No hard feelings, I hope. Wait just a minute! What about the other person? What about the other person that went to the studio? The boy! When his photo I erased. He's only saying a third grader, as you said. He's only grade school, though, as you said. Second or third grade, was it? That doesn't matter! When I was a, when I was a, that age, I could pin my old man in 10 seconds tops. Hmm. Your thoughts, Mr. Wright? That boy's not the killer. What? How can you be so sure? Oh, oh is it the nasty kid that means your elders day for snapper? I have proof. Proof? Indeed. Then let's see this proof, Mr. Wright. Your proof is that the boy cannot commit this murder? The scene of the murder, as we all know, is Studio One. However, you need a key card to enter Studio One. How could a boy with no formal relations to the studios have a key card? I see. I see. Well, that w would the witness care to comment on this? Yep. The wind bag. Speechless. This gotta be a first. Very well. This court will suspend the proceedings on the current trial for today. Mr. Edwards, please find out more about your witness, Miss Wendy. What was her name? Something old bag, Your Honor, Governor. 
the, the prosecution will look forward into this old bag before we continue. That's all, the court is adjourned. Run off, barking up, up, up the wrong tree. Me? I'm talking. Oh great! Stop the presses. The wind bag wants to talk. Miss Oldbag, what is this all about? Have you admitted something? From your testimony? Actually, if you must know, there was something I was told not to talk about. About by whom? I mean, it wasn't Edward told not to talk? Well, we'll testify. Oops, we're sealed. Global Studios will make quite about something. There were some other people at the studio on the day of the murder. They said they had nothing to do with it, see? So, they told me just to just pretend they had been at the studio that day. But if you're gonna go Accusing me, I'm not letting them get away scot free. M Mrs. Oldbag. This is Christopher Mason. Why did you keep it from the court until just now? Ain't you been listening? They told me to shut my trap, and I always do what I'm told. Hmm. No. No, this isn't a bad dream, Your Honor. Witness the power of the old bag. Mr. Wright, your cross-examination. My lips are sealed. The level studios will make you quiet about something. So... You were told not to talk. That's right, by the steel and the TV wake, no less. Why didn't I hear about this? Don't be too behind yourself, Sonny. We were all in on it. There were some other people at the studio on the day of the murder. Who were these other people? Well, the director and the producer for starters. The director? We should have known something was fishy. How could they have done a run through of their accent scene without a, a director, Gavna? Of course. Yes, well, I was surprised. No one asked about it. So, where were these people? The director was in the play area all morning for the one through. He joined the producer around lunchtime, and they had a meeting after that. Where? Uh oh, in the Studio 2 trailer. S studio 2? There was a Studio 2. Well, well, if you look at the guide map. Here it is. You go to the gate all the, and all the way to the left. The path with the monkey's head was falling over. <laughs> well, Mr. Wright, you like to see the cross exam examination? I think I asked all my questions, but. Yeah. Your Honor. We have learned that there, there are others at Global Studios in the quest, day in the question. 
The director and the producer and er uh, some big wigs were all present. Yes, we stand here. They have not been questioned. I held it is impossible to declare a verdict on the Lieutenant Mr. Powers. Hmm. The court knows the defense's point. The prosecution will gather more information about the witness, Miss Oldbag, more information about the other people we have just been told of. Grrr. I understand, Your Honor. This is the day for seeing the trial of Mr. Will Powers. That is all. Court is adjourned. October 18th, 104 p.m. District Court in lobby number three. Thank you so much, Mr. Wright. I was right to ask you to defend me. Oh, really? It's nothing. Smile. Oh, or should I sniff? We're going down to the studio to do some more investigation. We need to find out more about this director and producer. Are we turning up in the next trial as witnesses for certain? So now's my chance to get material for their cross examination. So, Nick, have you figured out just who it was in this deal ceremony costume? Could it really have been. Old windbag? What do you think, Mr. Powers? I don't think it was her. Really. Neither do I, Nick. Yeah, I know. Look, I was just buying time back there. Someone had to be the bad guy for a bit to take up the pressure off Mr. Powers. Poor old windbag. I kind of feel sorry for her. Well, she wasn't willing any points in there with or without my execution. Okay, let's get down to the studios. Right! We'll be back to visit you soon! Thanks. Thanks, guys. Sniff. To be continued. Oh, all right. Whew. That might voice for a while, but I. Right. It's time for more investigations. We'll see what happens next time, or maybe we're gonna be some more Kingdom Hearts. Anyways, like, thumb up you, thumb up you, like it if you do, thumb up you like it or not, and hit that hit that bell. And never stop, never stop learning and enjoy the rest of this. All right, we'll see you next time. Bye.